hello y'all sorry it's been a minute since i've been doing a check-in but tonight we're gonna do a collective check-in and see what's coming near us with this full moon approaching i hope everybody out there has been doing good and everyone is being kind and really just you know trying to be in your you know high mindset you know, being your higher self, you know, even when coming into confrontational situations, and it's not always easy, but, you know, being the best you could be in these times, you know, I'm hoping everyone and wishing everyone the best of luck and, you know, peace in your life right now. And I'm going to ask, you know, my guardian angel, and my ancestors and spirit guides to help me get you a clear message today and see what the cards have to say, see what the tarot has to say or wants to tell us at this time before the moon comes in. So I'm gonna start with my visionary tarot. And, oh, let me light my candle, my bad. This is one that I made. It smells so good. It's clear. It burns for a long time, so I wanted to look at that flame. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Can you see it? Let me see. It's not even in the shot. Let me move it. There we go. It'll go down. Well, seems like we have the attention of somebody. So let's get going on this. Spirit guide, angels, and ancestors, and angels who protect me. Please protect me as I ask for answers for the collective. Okay, I ask that protection, that God keep your wings and angels keep your wings around me as I ask these questions. Amen. So, I'm going to start out with uh, illusions, which is the moon energy and rebirth. What else we get? I'm only taking flippers. One more. And we have the six of flames, six of wands. Okay, we're gonna start with those. On the bottom of the deck, we have the world. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Okay, so even under the world card, we have the two of flames, two of wands, choosing a direction. So it looks like, you know, there were maybe in the past for some of the collective, you know, illusions, you know, it looks like you're coming out of that cancer energy, cancer Pisces, illusions, you know. Okay, but there's a rebirth at this time. We have a rebirth. Onward to Six of Wands. That's recognition, victory. Coming into a whole new beginning, a whole new world. How exciting. You know, just straight off, I'm excited about this journey it seems like a progressive journey has occurred i mean transformation is right here with this rebirth card the only thing we want to clarify perhaps in this is the illusions i mean it doesn't really need much you know the past is the past but let those be lessons learned I really feel like, you know, I want to leave this a, 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 a light message, you know, miss so light, you know, as we reflect and move forward in rebirth, let's reflect on these lessons. Let's not be in any illusions. So we're going to clarify those. Let me clarify. Verify those real quick. And let's 
four of cups wanted to pop out. Okay, so there was some discontent, you know, boredom. But you're not seeing that golden cup. You was in an illusion about that golden cup, you know, or some discontent, boredom in the past, confusion. And then we have the temperance card. An angel. Balance. Oh, there was some unhappiness there. So let's see. We have discontent with temperance. So maybe you weren't settled in in your mindset when you was trying to gain balance and it made you unhappy. You know, this is like levels of it, you know, the feelings, the emotions you might have been going through because you you were confused. You were in, in, in like, shit wasn't real. Pardon my language, you know. This could have been about a Sagittarius or a Leo or even a water sign, you know. But you couldn't see this cup that was being offered to you. One foot in, one foot out on it. It made you unhappy. Could have been. Got the four of wands on the bottom and five of cups and regret in the tower. So there was, a, and there's that world card again. So this is you thinking, uh, you know, about your home, your stability, and there's some regret there. And then there, there was a tower, but it's a whole new world for you. It's a whole new world, you know? It's a whole new world. Look at this. It's saying it all over here. This rebirth. This world card. This transformation. It's a whole new world. Quiet is kept. The, you know, the high priestess is, is the, the, the keeper of secrets. The, she leads us and guides us. You know? You know what you're doing now. You've learned these lessons. You got the victory. You got the victory. All right? You know the way. You learned the lessons. The high priestess is here. So um, I'm going to give us... Let me do Romance Angel. Let's see what happens. Honeymoon. Enjoy. The bliss of holiday time together. It's your victory. This could be the one. This could be the one. Hold on. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Okay. Let me do a psychic card. Got two. Doorways and ego. You got doorways and ego. So there's doors opening and opportunities coming your way. It's the 1111 card and 12. Opportunities and that will take you to ascend to higher places. Wow. Can't go wrong with these. Look at that. Doorways and op opportunities. And one language of light there for you. I'm going to wrap this up. I missed you, Collective. And that is the authentic truth. Yes. Okay. Always give your authentic truth. I'm going to read it to you. Authentic truth. Oh, that's so beautiful. It 
It's the number four. Authentic truth. Discover your truth and light others find theirs. Wait. Discover your truth and let others find theirs. The truth will see set you free. So long as you recognize there is more than one truth and that the answers you seek exist beyond the beliefs you hold now. There are many truths in this world. You don't have to believe them all. Just focus on what resonates with you. If you must convince yourself of your beliefs, they are not your truth. Your truth will always fulfill and satisfy. It is unconditional, meaning conditions don't have to change for you to live and fuel your truth. Okay, so I hope something that you, in this message resonated with you. I hope you found something that you felt was true for you in this message. Remember, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. No problem is deeper than the ocean. Live moment to moment. This is just one moment. Take your time to think it through. I'm Miss Solite. Thank you for coming to my channel. Hope to see you again. Take care. Bye-bye.